pigeon pigeon fine fine sleek sleek kneel kneel inspect inspect Belly, belly, exclaim, exclaim, stoop, stoop. Examine, examine, already, already, expect, expect. Porridge, porridge, pale, pale, tuck, tuck. Purse, purse, if you can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. If you can't tolerate the pressures of a particular situation, remove yourself from that situation. When Chris got a position as a legal secretary with one of the most prestigious law firms in the city, he was elated. However, it was not long before he became snowed under with work. As the pressures of the job increased, he began to complain about the long hours and the excessive amount of work. One day, after a fellow employee heard him complain once again about the stack of paperwork on his desk, she quite bluntly told him, if you can't stand the heat, get out of the kitchen. Actually, Chris had been thinking about quitting. After only three months on the job, it became apparent to him that since he could not handle the pressures of the job, he should leave the firm and seek employment elsewhere. The only reason he had been hanging on was because good jobs were so hard to come by. Leave well enough alone. Don't try to improve something that is already satisfactory. Greetings, Vicky. What have you been up to lately? Oh, I've been busy working on my sculpture for the Spring Art Exhibition. I'm just not satisfied with the symmetry between the head and the torso. I'm no kind of sir, but when I saw your sculpture last week, I was very impressed. Really, Vicky, don't change a thing. Leave well enough alone. If you keep trying to improve your sculpture, you might end up ruining it. Do you really think so? Absolutely. There's no reason for you to change something that is already satisfactory. Maybe you're right. I'll sleep on it and see how I feel about the whole thing tomorrow. <laughs>